Hi guys, welcome or welcome back. Today we're checking out Psycho's third mini album, Trial and Error. We already checked out, or I already checked out. We don't stop, so I'm skipping that. But yeah, we have five more songs. Super excited to check it out. Starting off with Trial and Error, Rare Bouts, which is an instrumental. So yeah, let's listen to that. Wait, you can't hear? <laughs> All right. Instrumentals always the short. What? I need a whole song with that. That sounds so good. Holy shit. Also, I just realized that it wasn't an official audio. Sorry about that. But what? Okay. Red Sun. <clears throat> I was just about to say how rap heavy the song is. And then Hyunwoo comes in. And just, oh my god. This instrumental is crazy. And then you have that completely change. Oh, 
holy shit, what do I even say to that? They know. They know how good they are. That's what the song told me. Holy shit. Okay. Whoa, stop. Okay. Oh. That change uh, into the verse after the chorus is felt like whiplash in the best way possible. Awesome. Oh, oh my god. Okay. <sighs> Super Kelly Fragilistic. Super Kelly Fragilistic. Huh. Okay. This reminds me, I know of the the one movie with the nanny, like the magical nanny. I never watched it. I don't I can't remember the name now. And I know it's a classic. Never watched it still. But I know of that one phrase that's like super long word with the awesome whatever. That reminded me of that. I don't know if that's the exact or part of the exact phrase, super califragilistic or not, but yeah. All right, let's check it out. Never mind, I'm not drinking. I love the ad loves. I know what Manitou means just because of one BTS. Ooh. Ooh, I love the melody of the line. I feel like I'm on, on in a rave, on, on at a rave at times. It's gonna be insane. Okay. Whew. Every flavor jelly, it just makes me think of Harry Potter. Every flavored 
Bertie Bots beans is different, but like okay, every flavor. Oh, not a piano. It just like a I mean, that can be interpreted in a different way as well. Okay, I think this is the last one, right? I don't even need to hear it to know this is also gonna be like three albums in a row, min three mini albums in a row, and they're all no skips. What the fuck, Psychus? Like, literally. <laughs> Break a leg. Let's finish this. Oh, this feels very 2000s. Early 2000s. Like Eva Levine.
girl who turned hands tightly. Oh. When everyone covers themselves with blankets, we lace up our shoes, we get ready. And probably working the whole night. Instead of sleeping. <coughs> even if it's not flashy, I'm okay, even the world is blocked, it's okay for me. I love the filter on that electric guitar. Again, like <sighs> I forgot what I wanted to say. Damn it. <laughs> oh, yeah, I feel like especially the rap line, like, it had a lot more, uh. The vocalists were great, right? But for me, I think the rap line stood out more in this album. And especially because a lot of times I felt like a lot of rap heavy songs, especially in the beginning. So good. So good. Yeah, man. They're definitely my favorite group that debuted in the last year. Closely followed by One Page because they have, they only have one more album out and that fucking killed me. But man, also one year and we have three mini albums. Like they putting in the work. That's so much music. Jesus. All right. <clears throat> That's it for this album reaction. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.